thanks for tuning in to some How to Play Golf SGT style. So today, instead of just doing a, um, you know, I thought I'd do something different. And, you know, I've been a golf pro for 20 odd years, so about 20 years, maybe 10, no, no, 20. Um, and I thought I'd, I'd just throw a few little tips out there. I don't, I don't do much in the way of instruction. And so uh, on these videos, so I thought I'd just give a little helping hand to those in, in various areas. And today, I want to talk about pressure. Pressure, uh, you know, ground reaction forces and, you know, potentially helping those people that might hit the ball fat or thin, they struggle with their contact. And what I find, you know, with a lot of people is they might be, they might be you know, hanging back, hitting off their back foot a little bit, you know, that chucking the club and coming a little bit outside in and doing all this sort of stuff. One of the key elements to hitting some nice shots is to make sure that the pressure in our feet is good. Okay, so by that I mean, you know, when we're swinging back, we definitely get pressure, you know, on our, on the back swing, the pressure is left toe. That is my left, isn't it? Left toe and right heel. Okay, as I swing back, left toe, right heel. And then as I swing down, our pressure then switches. switches. We get a slight little bump forward, right? And that bump forward, will occur with all good play, with not, I shouldn't say all, with most really good strong players that when the club is going back, the club is still going back and they've already started to put their pressure on the left. Okay, so this is still going back. The body has already started to go forward. Okay, so we don't really have a backswing and then a downswing. We have a backswing that's occurring with the club, but while this is still going back, Good players already shifted, okay? Shifted forward and they're starting to turn. That's how they get into these wonderful, you know, open hips, open chest, impact positions. So I'm going to give you a little quick tip on how to do that better, that transition or starting that downswing, okay? So I, I've done this sort of thing for a while and it's, you know, mostly with my feet and I will step up and down like this. You know, I'll be taking my dress and I'll just be doing this. It's habit. I've done it for years, right? As it turns out, it's a pretty good habit to have. But with this drill, the, the easier version, right, is to just, when we're swinging back, is to lift the heel. Okay, just swing back and lift your heel. Now, what you want to do is you want to get it down quick, right? So I'm going to take a little swing, lift the heel, and get it down. Okay? So we go again, we swing back, we lift the heel and get it down. Now by, by, by pressing that heel down, by pressing it down, it's going to get my weight forward, okay, and down. All right, so that's, that's the, that's the um, you know, the first step is to lift the heel, press it down as soon as you can, right, up and down. So up, 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 down. Right, and you can hear that contact's pretty good, okay? So now for a little bit more advanced, and I, and I warm up this way, to be honest, this next way, is to actually take the foot off the ground. Okay, so this one here, I'm gonna lift my left foot and plant it back down, right? Up and down. Now, I don't want to go up and over here and, whoosh, you know, hit myself in the cankle, right? But we want to go up, down, okay? You can hear that contact, that compression's pretty good. I'm going to go again, up, down, okay? And so I'm starting to get that pressure. You know, if we're going to kick off the ground and get real good force, good contact, first thing we're going to do is press down, right? So like I say, we're going to go again, swing back, up, down, and down, you know, up, down. It's going to get our body moving in the right direction. It's going to get your body moving forward, up and down. Just a quick little tip. Try it out. I, 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 you know, it's going to really improve that contact 
It's going to get your low point more forward. It's going to get your weight more forward. And I don't want, I'm not talking about big sways back and, you know, this is dancing. We don't want to do this. We just want to go up and down or heel off, whatever it might be, just to get that downswing started, you know, nicely. So there's a little tip for you. Be sure to look out for more tips along the way. Um, click on that uh, like and subscribe button and uh, check out our website for any goodies that you might like for some Christmas shopping any month of the year. And uh, thanks for tuning in.